Hey, today we're taking a look at the Apple Watch Series 2. It doesn't look a lot different on the outside, but it has a lot of stuff going on inside, and that includes a design that seals out water. You can take this thing swimming, and as you can see here, the Apple Watch Series 2 has open water swim as one of the exercises that's available. If I click on the side button over here, you'll see that Watch OS 3 kicks in, and then I'm able to switch applications very easily, uh, one of which is this Ranger app that takes advantage of the built-in GPS. So yes, you can take the Apple Watch Series 2 for a run and track your pace and distance and use it with other apps without having to bring along your phone. That's huge for people who like to work out and like to run like me. The other thing that's cool to show off here is a Night Sky app. And as you can see, thanks to the built-in uh, Series 2 S2 processor, uh, it really does keep up with your movement. So you're going to see a lot of developers tapping in to this new processor. Uh, as far as the uh, overall price goes, you're looking at $369. Uh, but in terms of like, for people who are on the sidelines and wondering whether or not they should get an Apple Watch, the Apple Watch Series 2 definitely improves things with built-in GPS, the fact that you can take it underwater, and improved software. Uh, so not bad for the price, and I think Apple Watch will probably stay in the smartwatch league. This is a quick look at the Apple Watch Series 2, and this is Mark Strunauer with Tom Cat.